Hey guys, this is Pharaoh2091, and welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories Reverse Rebirth. Last time we left off, we finished Agriba, and we found out a little bit more about uh, the little conversation going between Vexen, Alexius, and Zexen, whatever, and it seems they look up to Riku in a sense. Oh, well, kinda, but yeah, whatever. So, as I mentioned before, we're gonna go ahead and go to Monstro. Yay! I, one of my least, uh... Yeah, I don't like the world at all. It's pretty much like between Monstro and, like, Atlantica. I just... I never, I never really was fond of Neverland either, but, you know, hey. What can you do? So, yeah, Neverland... I mean, Monstro, Neverland, and Traverse Town. We're gonna go to Monstro first. I should... I should get rid of, uh... Finish this whole entire world in this episode. I just gotta... Of course, I'm gonna have to cut out like the hour or so of grinding and ugh, or just clearing the rooms. Cause you know me, I could skip it all, but you know me, the fight's there. I gotta take it. All right. So as you can see, boom, enter world, and there we go. Uh, well, first, let me take a look at the deck, cause as I mentioned before, it always changes depending on where you go. So seven five four one seven five four. Okay. So. Seven and five are good, good. Four is a little low, and they gave us a one. That's terrible, but, you know, whatever. We, we can still work with that. And the ending, other stuff is like three, two, uh, whatever. But they give us Search Ghost. Absorbs enemy HP when striking enemy cards. With enemy cards. Attack cards, damn it. Uh, but we don't get as many items or whatever. And we get Jafar. Stops enemies from breaking... Attack cards that you use. All right, and we always keep them, we always keep them moves in that. At least I think we do anyway. So yeah, we keep any of the boss cards we I, we go through, and I believe the world itself gives you like a unique card to that world. So there we go. Uh, it's not a bad deck overall. So except for the ones and the world itself, well, not that many. Interesting. It's not only what, what, oh, here we go. So I'm assuming this is probably the room, it's an exit room, so it's one, two, three, four, five. Oh, once again, five rooms. Not bad. At least it shouldn't take me that long anyway. Alright, let's go ahead and fight, like, a couple battles, and then I'll cut it off and we'll fight, uh, well, you know, Parasite Cage. I, at least I believe that's who we're gonna be fighting. And that one's really gonna. That one's really gonna cause some problems, I think it is, anyway. Oh, there we go. Uh, the experience right now is we're not we're not getting that high of experience as of yet, but uh, you know, I feel like the game kind of goes in a slower pace, especially in the beginning of the game. But uh, whatever. Let me just power up my part my power up my cards a little bit. There we go. I, I probably could be using more of the Riku's uh, dark powers or you know his dark mode, but. I kind of just go along, kind of mashing X, as long as I... Oops, kind of just going along mashing X, you know? It's, to me, it's not really big of a deal to use dark mode. I can definitely see the, uh, see the point of doing it um, during a fight, or during a boss battle. That would be you, nice to use it. Oh, since AP is given to us, definitely raise your AP. So it's kind of like the, uh, the slights for Sora, like I mentioned before. It takes priority. Um, okay, I'll show off one more fight. How about that? Because there's really nothing interesting going on here. Did I ever show these off before, like, any of the rooms? There's, some, there's a couple room worlds where they have, like, items like this that, like, stop a stop an enemy or hurts them. And then you can go ahead and attack them, and that gives you a little advantage. And I still missed, like an idiot. Oh, well. They're frozen either way, so. Well. I probably could have taken more advantage of it, but, you know, whatever. Yeah, they're gonna keep breaking my cards a little bit, but... What can we do? Oh, god, the Search Ghost. Have we seen them before? I mean, have we seen them in Riku yet? I'm not really sure. Uh, the Gargoyles, I... Or Air Pirates, I... No, the Gargoyles, I think. I can't remember their damn names anymore. Never really was, uh... I used to remember, like, a majority of the Heartless's names. But, I kind of... Now it's like... I can't really remember. And there we go. Alright, so... 
Alright, I guess that's all I'm going to show for right now. So, as I said, I'm going to go ahead and clear out all these rooms, and I'll meet you guys back when we're about to fight Parasite Cage. I'll see you in a little bit. Alright guys, I'm back. I cleared out the rooms, as you guys can see here. Pretty much a straight shot through, and as you can see, I used a bunch of Teeming Darkness level up a little bit more. I th I'm level 21 right now, and I got a little bit more HP, more DP. I believe I, I raised my attack once, so we're all good. We're pretty much set. So, if you know who, to, you should know who the boss is. It's gonna be Parasite Cage, because that's, well, he's a monster that inhabits, uh, that inhabits, uh, Monstro's stomach, or belly, whatever you want to call it. Uh, so, a five and a higher. Okay, that's a, I doubt I'm gonna be using any of these. Alright, and there we go. Alright, let's see how Parasite Cage is gonna be now. Uh, because I'm starting to think, I don't think there's any gimmick cards, like, you know, like, Sora had, like, it had, like, the Mickey symbol on it. I don't think Riku get... No, what the hell am I talking about? Yes, he does. Never mind. I just remembered, yeah, I got the platform lifts it, and I just... But I never, uh... I could never use it properly, because, uh... What the hell's I gonna say? I never used it properly, because, well, they just never gave it to me. Or I couldn't really use it well. But how am I trying to say? I didn't have the chance to use it. Every time, as soon as I went up, got on there... They like, it, like kicked me off. I'm like, oh bastard. Uh, I just probably not. He's probably gonna break it, but you know whatever. Oh no, he didn't break it. Oh, here's a given card. We just wait till he. Uh... There we go. I think we got this fight in the bag somewhat. I know I haven't using, I haven't used duels um, lately. And I don't know. I don't know. I just don't think with these fights, I don't think there's any purpose. I mean, look at that. That was pretty simple, and I didn't even have any strategy to it. I just kept choosing, I kept, someone avoided the, uh, the low cards, and if I did play a low card, I tried doing it when he wasn't, uh, gonna break it, or I tried timing it so he wouldn't break it. But, really, strategy kind of just flew out the door, in my opinion. I mean, in my opinion, I don't know. Uh, well, there we go, that was very easy. That could be just because, you know, it was the beginning of the game... You know, I still got a little while to go, but I, I think this is going pretty well. A lot better than what I expected anyway, because I believe I mentioned this. I never played or never finished uh, Riku's story. I got like, um, I think I got to like the sixth floor of the basement or something like that, and I think that's where I stopped, but, uh, whatever. And, uh, well, I guess we're going to head out here and, uh... See the new. Well, I am going to be going to Neverland next, but I'm sure there's going to be a cutscene right before I go in there, so we'll take a look at that and uh, we'll see what's in store for us. I'm not sure, because, you know, sometimes there, there, there might be, like, you know, uh, like some type of boss fight in between the worlds, but I'm not really sure if I can even remember any of that actually happened or not. Uh, we'll find out sooner or later. You know, what's fun and kind of disturbing? You're climbing bones. I don't know, I find that somewhat disturbing in, in this kind of game. I don't know why the hell I just kind of noticed that. But before we head off, I'm going to take a quick look at what, um... What that Parasite Cage card does. Nullifies the enemy card. Hmm. I guess we can use that. Alright. Let's see. Yeah, oh, there's a cutscene. I take it you're Riku. Are you with Ansem? You are half correct. Let us say that he is not the Ansem with which you are familiar. He is Ansem, and he is not Ansem. Perhaps a nobody best conveys the idea. Riddles were never my thing. Try again. He belongs to neither the light nor the dark, but walks the twilight between. <laughs> Catching on now? Oh, yes. You also stand in between the light and the darkness. It appears we have much in common. Maybe. Like you said, there really is darkness left inside of me. But so what? Darkness is my enemy! And so are you for reeking of that awful smell! Oh, so it's a fight you want. 
Very good. I shall take you on. Well, I totally forgot about that. We gotta fight you, Vexen. And, well, we know that Rika won't finish him off. It's gonna be Sora, so... Oh god, I can't remember how this is gonna go. Well, he, he usually has the same tactic. I'm gonna see if I can try, um... I'm gonna see if I can do card duel him. Oops, uh... He's... Damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh well. He tried. Actually, I can try again, can't I? Uh, you know, screw it. I just want to fight him. Oh, damn it. This is not going to work. I, I got to break his cards. I think I want to go into dark mode. But he's playing kind of high cards here. Woo. There we go. Damn it. Now oh, I'm a bastard. Play low cards. Come on. I'm almost there. See, that's what I kind of hate about these fights. It's like you really do have to get into dark mode to really unleash some damage. At least in my opinion. Ah, damn it. Oh. There we go. Should be able to get him out. Oh, 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 okay. That, not good. I didn't even see his health there. It's kind of high. Let's see. What can I do? Oh, yep, I'm gonna die, guys. Yep, just kind of look like that. And that one, I was being stupid. Uh, let's see. It's so hard. it's just hard because he doesn't. Riku doesn't have any damn slides. I can't really use anything. Oh, and I died. Yay! Boo! Whatever. Let's try again. I was just not prepared at all. Kind of, yeah, I was really caught off guard. Oh, what? I got... Ugh. Let's see, what can I use? It would be nice if I can, like, really... If I could really, uh... Do a card break. I guess I can keep pressing X until I keep breaking all his cards. I mean, I guess that's a tactic you're gonna be wasting a lot, but... It's a, it's something you could use. Uh... Well, let's try that. Let's try that tactic. If he just hurries up and plays a damn card... Oh, damn it. Just play eight, seven, come on. Oh, he's gonna do this crap on purpose. Okay, damn it. Okay. There we go. See, that wasn't bad. Could have gone a lot better, but, you know, whatever. Yeah, that was gonna be good. Well, let's see if we can do that card break again. Come on. Or I could just... Ah, what can I do here? I'm still trying to figure out what I want to do. I could catch him off guard. Seems to be working as well. Uh, do I have zero? I do have zero. I... I I just don't like how the cards are laid out. Where the hell are my zeros at? Like, oh, after. After everything was gone. Come on. Damn it! Urgh! Pissing me off! This is why I wish I had more healing, but... Oh, never mind. I, got my, I guess I got my wish somewhat. Well, I'm afraid he's gonna break it. If I can reach a dark break, I'll be happy. Probably one of my favorite slights to use. There we go. Come on, there we go. Slowly but surely, we're like draining his health a little bit. Uh, crap, crap, damn it all, don't kill me. Yeah, I have, I'm just kind of wasting my cards at the moment. It probably isn't good, but... He's almost dead. He's almost dead. Damn it all. Come on. Yeah, I'm spamming right now. I'm getting a little worried here. There we go. We got it. There we go. Alright, yeah. You know, there is strategy involved. I, I'll take back what I say about it. it's just more action-y. 
there is strategy, it's just I suck at it. Um Well, there we go. <laughs> I find coursing through you there is a darkness of formidable power growing, well worth the trouble of aggravating you. All this excitement has provided me with invaluable data. What? <laughs> Many thanks, Riku. <sighs> it was a trick all along. So is that how Vexen created that Riku replica? He used, he, he guess, I guess he used the, the fight data. I don't know how, but he gathered it and um, I guess that's how he created the replica. That's interesting to know. <coughs> uh, excuse me. All right, but there we go, guys. That was, uh... That was the Vexen boss fight. Uh, Strategy-wise, if you could, you could, I think it's either between going to dark mode and like unleashing all those really powerful slights. But the thing is, you gotta watch out that you don't waste all your cards. Like to me, I knew I had a good abundance, and I, I had a feeling that I was able to kill him before I actually ran out of cards. You could do that. It's kind of a risky way to do it. Or you can try dueling, and there are times where. Oh, I've seen people just duel straight up, and they can win fights just like that, but I tend I hate the dueling system, and, well, I, yeah, I kinda, it's not my favorite at all, so... Well, in any case, uh, there we go. That, w that wasn't bad, but... Eh, whatever. Oh, wow. Okay. Well... Next time, guys, we're gonna go to Neverland, and, uh, I'm sure you guys know we're probably gonna be fighting Captain Hook and see what Never Neverland has in store for us. So, as usual, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time for Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Rechain Memories Reverse Rebirth. See you guys later.